Hello and welcome back to my channel. My name is H. I'm always doing unboxing and review for the products. Maybe it will help you when you buy your one. Today I have the beast in my opinion is Shark Upright Vacuum. This model is called, I written it down because it's so long, NZ801UK. <laughs> so let's do unboxing for this product and make some review. Let's go. When you open the box, the first thing you'll find is a manual, which describes every part of the vacuum. And here is a floor motorized nozzle. It's really well built material. And down below the nozzle, you will find the soft roller and the brush roller. Both of them, you can unplug them out easily. And here is the first accessory you will find, which is a polystry tool and the crevice tool, which helps you to clean tight spaces, reach skirting boards and ceilings by clicking this button. You can change between brush mode to crevice mode. Then we will find the hose connected to the multifunction handle. And this mode switch can help you to change between carpet cleaning mode and hard floor mode. And by this switch, you can change the strength of the suction. And we will find the metal wand. And finally, we have the vacuum. On the top, we will find the power button and the left away button. And on the side, we'll find the handle release button. Easy to take it out and easy to put it back in. And on this side, we'll find the maximum mark to tell us when we have to empty the dust pot. Now I'll show you how to empty the dust pot by clicking on the dust cup empty buttons from the top from the down. Now I will show you the filter from inside, which contains the foam filter, and the felt filter. They are washable, but don't use hot water and make sure to dry them 100% before you install them back to the vacuum. And there is another filter, which is a post motor filter. Now I'm going to show you how to take it out and clean it and as I told you before on the other filters, normal water not hot, make them dry 100% and put them back.
And now let's fit every part, starting from the handle to connect it to the wand. Okay, let's back to work. I'm going to connect the hose head to the vacuum. Use it from this side and make sure to hear the click. Connect the vacuum to the floor nozzle. And to take it out, you can use a lift away button. and put it back and don't forget to hear the click. Let's connect the wand to the vacuum through this hole. On this button, we can click on it to take out the wand and put it back so easy. Now I have the cord. As you can see the hooks, the upper hook will return it. And then we will roll the cord around this way. And use this small rubbery hook to keep the cord tightly together. And now how to use the accessory. First we have to take out the cord by turning the upper hook and take out the cord and then I take out the wand and fit our accessory to it so easy. As you can see, the angle of this vacuum can make it so easy for us to reach certain places. And by clicking the lift away button, it will make it very easy for you to clean under your furniture. I hope it was simple and easy. This is how I show you and uh, how to uh, fit every part in the vacuum. And uh, I really love it, uh, but need some tests for a few days, as you know. Um, actually, the quality, I really love it. The packing itself, it was amazing. Um, I think if you get it for your home, believe me, you'll not regret. And if you want to buy this product, you'll find the link under the video in the description you can order it and don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel and ring the bell so you'll get all the update of the new videos i release on my channel thank you have a good day